The 2018-19 season is a big year for the John Jay Bloodhounds. Picked to finish second in the CUNY Athletic Conference, John Jay has won three of its first four games and has been led by junior center Doug Levy. In his first four games, Levy has averaged 15.5 points a game to go along with his 13 rebounds and four blocks per contest. In other words, he's been a machine. I put a lot of pressure on myself in that regard. Uh, I knew freshman year, like after the season, that I struggled a lot. And I think the general consensus was that it was because I was kind of out of shape, a little overweight. So I like to keep myself to a high standard now at least. And so that was a big part of it. And I was told the off season was a great time to, to get in great shape. So I did all I could and had to fight for it, but here I am. Doug really worked hard and, and took the criticism and, and took the, the coaching that our staff gave to him to heart. Um, we talked to him about getting in better shape and getting stronger and, and not just slimming down to the point where he can move more freely, but really becoming a presence in the post where he was a mismatch, whether he was on the perimeter or in the post versus a bigger guy or a smaller guy, uh, quicker versus bigger, and obviously bigger versus some of the quicker guys. Um, Doug took it to heart, and all the transformation that he's made is, is really all credit to him. He isn't afraid to tell me straight up what I need to work on, and he told me that the biggest thing was to, you know, transform my body into essentially a college athlete body because I didn't have that freshman year. Um, so him holding me accountable definitely helped that process. A common workout was basically morning, just going to the track, getting a good run in, doing a lot of sprints. Um, I also worked for a moving company, so that definitely helped the process too, having like 14 hour days of just straight lifting furniture. Um, but really just being consistent with it, I think that was the biggest thing too. There would be times I remember back in high school where I would just take a lot of days off and do nothing. It was just got to be consistent, have a, like a good workout program. With the 6'8 frame, Levy has always been one of the taller players on the court, but his basketball growth was non-traditional. It's, it's actually funny. Um, I actually I only played one year of high school basketball, realistically. Um, they definitely wanted me down low, just because obviously I was a lot bigger than most kids were back then. But I found myself a better shooter when I was younger, so I actually had to develop my skills inside first before I can go outside again, if that makes sense. Um, but yeah, definitely in high school, they saw me as a, like a true like five, so I definitely played a lot in the paint. In his first two seasons, the Bloodhounds record was a combined 23 and 31, including a nine game losing streak to start Levy's career. However, Levy now feels all the pieces for a special season are coming together. Definitely the first two years were, were a big struggle because we always had all these new kids coming in. And I remember we had, I think, nine new kids my first year, and then like eight new kids the second year. So it's always hard to build that chemistry right away. And we always didn't have like the greatest leadership. But now that, you know, we're all like upperclassmen, like I said, like me, Sean, and Jordan, like it, we definitely try to hold people accountable. And I think that's the biggest thing because freshmen definitely change the course of it like a season, you know, you got to have them engaged the whole time. And the coaches definitely do their best to hold us accountable as well. Um, I think this is the most talented roster we've had by far since I've been here. Um, we've had talent in the past, but a lot of egos have gotten in the way. And I think this year we've got definitely the right mix of talent with the right mindset that, hey, you know, we're not going to do this on our own. Like we have five people on the court at all times that are going to help us do what we need to do to win games.